In this video, we're going to talk about Boyle's Law and show the relationship between the volume occupied by a sample of gas and the pressure applied to that gas. Boyle's Law states that the volume occupied by a gas is inversely proportional to the pressure of the gas, assuming, of course, that we maintain a constant temperature and that the amount of gas also remains constant. In other words, as the pressure on a gas is decreased, the volume will increase. The apparatus for today's experiment will be a bell jar placed on a vacuum pump. If we place a balloon that contains a small amount of air inside the bell jar and then use the vacuum pump to remove air pressure from the bell jar, we can watch how the volume of the gas inside the balloon changes because the size of the balloon will change. So let's give this a try. I take a balloon and tie a knot in it so as to trap a small amount of air inside the balloon. I then place the balloon inside a bell jar that's connected to a vacuum pump. I turn on the vacuum pump which removes the air and consequently the air pressure from inside of the bell jar. We see the volume of the balloon is increasing because the volume occupied by the gas inside the tied up balloon increases as the pressure on the balloon decreases. Finally, when I open the bell jar to atmospheric pressure, the pressure inside the bell jar begins to increase and therefore the volume of the balloon decreases. To recap, Boyle's Law predicts that the volume of a gas will increase when the pressure decreases. We've seen this in action by placing a sealed balloon inside the bell jar. As the pressure in the bell jar decreases, the balloon gets bigger.